Barnes muzzleloader bullets are famous for their terminal performance. We introduced our first expanding all-copper muzzleloader bullet in 1994, right on the heels of the XBB pistol bullet. Today, we have four different sabotaged muzzleloader bullet designs tailored specifically for inline muzzleloading rifles in 45, 50, and 54 calibers in various weights. Back then, we never imagined we'd be putting boat tails and plastic tips on muzzleloader bullets. The public demanded a higher standard, and that's what these bullets provide. The Spitfire TEZ bullet features a blue sabot that loads easily into muzzleloaders with tight or fouled bores. Barnes muzzleloader bullets use sabots to ensure a tight fit with the bore. Sabots help prevent gases from leaking past the bullet before it exits the muzzle. To compare how other muzzle-loading bullets stack up against Barnes copper bullets, we used a reduced charge to simulate a 100-yard impact when loading three different types of muzzle-loading bullets. We then fired each bullet into a 3-inch thick block of gelatin. This conventional cup and core bullet separates completely into an empty jacket, lead core, and tip. The result? Poor performance, even in a relatively soft target. Barnes T-EZ muzzleloader bullet fully expands, yet retains its weight for deep, dependable penetration. Here's how one competitor's non sabot bullet reacts in ballistic gelatin. Note the total lack of expansion. This bullet simply pencils straight through with the tip and gas check intact, causing little or no damage. Here's another look at how these popular muzzle-loading bullets compare. Which bullet would you put your confidence in? Barnes gives you reliable shot-to-shot -shot consistency combined with exceptional accuracy and terminal performance. There's no deformance when you use Barnes muzzleloader bullets. These flat-based bullets deliver the same match-grade accuracy all Barnes muzzleloader bullets are famous for. Results tell the tale.